Rick, do you have a question for Mr. Yeah, Sunny? How, um, how have you seen kind of food culture change over your period of doing all this? One of the biggest trends I see as I travel around the world is just making food has become cheaper. Even textiles has become cheaper. I mean, back in the day, people had a few shirts and a few pants. Now you could go to a village in the middle of nowhere and people will be wearing Nike and soccer jerseys and stuff like that. Likewise, in Africa, there used to be a lot more issues around hunger, but now they have corn and corn flour. That is like the main source of calories throughout many parts of Africa. And so you see that creeping into the diet more and more in places. And it's so much so that now in some places in Africa, you'll see a lot more overweight people and obesity because people are just throwing down a lot of this corn flour that they mix with flour. water. And then they, it's called ugali. So that's a trend over time, maybe over the last 50 years, not in the last seven.